French President Emmanuel Macron condemned Iran for accelerating its nuclear program and refusing to cooperate with the International Atomic Energy Agency during a meeting with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. Indonesia will take up its chairmanship of the Association of Southeast Asian Nations today. The European Union announced $546 million in military aid for Ukraine, and another $49 million to train Ukrainian forces, ahead of the EU-Ukraine summit in Kyiv. Qatar reportedly bribed former Afghan President Ashraf Ghani with $110 million to avoid resisting the Taliban's return to power. Turkey summoned the envoys of nine countries, including the US and UK, to protest the shutting down of their diplomatic missions.